Ladies and gentlemen, we're here. After what seems like forever, I am at the end of Stardust Crusaders. Episode 45, Dio's World Part 1. I'm today right here in this recording session. I'm going to record the final four episodes of Stardust Crusaders. And man, it's like kind of bittersweet. Like on one hand, I feel like parts of Stardust has been kind of a grind. Like there's been some episodes that to me felt flat, but other episodes, man, like, oh, hot dog. Do they hit you right in the feels? And they're just so beautiful. Like this whole, like, while I just said there was like parts I didn't like, the whole thing just feels like a crazy roller coaster of bizarreness and wonder. And it it's so different than part one and part two. Like part one is so tame compared to this. And part two, while it had like weirdness, this it, it feels like a blossoming flower of just so much things with Jojo. And uh yeah, I mean, like, again, sad to see it end, but I'm also excited to see this, like, conclusion, as well as get to part four and just, you know, et cetera, et cetera. I promised you guys that for this special occasion, I would have a little special thing. So, I have that special thing. Um, as you guys know, this is Joe Tro's hat. Um, I got this on Amazon for like 15 bucks. Uh, not the highest quality hat, but it, I think it gets the point across, right? Um, it's just Jotro's hat, and I will be wearing it for the final four episodes. Only downside, it's either it's either a cosplay hat or the fact that it's just kind of like cheaper in general. Uh, the hat is actually too small for me, and I have a large head. So um, I actually had to make some modifications. Uh, I actually cut out the back. You guys can't really see it on the can. It doesn't show up that well. But I basically cut this the the band in the back, so it would like help widen the hat. Um, but it's funny because it's actually very fitting because if you guys know like Jotaro, the whole thing is his hair like morphs into the hat in the back. So mine's essentially going to be doing that. Um, so let me go ahead and put it on and uh, give it a whirl. It's going to be a little bit um, hard to get right, but yeah, <laughs> I got his hat on, baby. And, uh, all right, let's put this on. Make sure this fits okay. Hopefully it works out. Ah, look at that. Not bad. Not bad, I think. Um, again, not a perfect fit. Uh, it's gonna be kind of like slanted or whatever, but that's kind of what Jotro's style is too anyway. Um, but yeah, just like his, my hair kind of like morphs into the back. So, um, woo, man, this hat makes you feel something special. Let me tell you. Um, again, you know, I didn't get like a $50 perfect replica of the hat, but I feel like this is kind of fun, right? Um, so yeah, hope you guys are entertained. You know, hopefully I go, I, the things I do for love to quote Courage the Cowardly Dog, anything, anything for you guys. Um, let me just finick it with a little bit, make sure it's all straight. Okay. That's as good as it's going to get. Um, not perfect, but you know, hope you guys enjoy and, uh, yeah, I don't know. I think it's kind of cool. Um, anyway, <clears throat> so yeah, <sighs> hitting record on this boom, boom, bop. Okay. This is Dio's world part one. Yada, yada. <laughs> All right. Uh, let me just make sure everything is good. Subtitles, I got to turn those back on. Okay. Again, I'm just so giddy about the hat. Sorry. I just want to make sure it's, I want to make sure it's on right too. Cause I don't have, it's not, it's not snugly fit because I don't have the back strap. It's like cut off. So there we go. That's, it's good enough. You guys get the point. Anyway, let's dive on in, in three, two, one, go. The end of Stardust Crusaders is upon us. Let's see what it has to offer. Probably a lot more sadness. Pulling the ref is not... I don't like where he's at right now. And we're getting right to it. Freaking Dio, man. Sexy evil all over again. Yep, gotta have a slow clap, right? <laughs> Huh. Well, 
What? Is that just to insult him by spitting on his curtain or what? Go down two steps. Oh. Whoa. Ha, 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 the music. Huh? Oh, no. I mean, I'm rooting for you, pull the riff, but. Man. Wow. Oh, I wish you would. I wish you would go and like, I guess you can't leave to go rejoin your friends, but. Oh, what? What? Whoa, what? That was a twist. Whoa. Was I right in this thing is time based? But that I don't know if that would be like time. That's almost like space manipulation almost. The world, yeah. I'm so curious to find out what it is. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Da, 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 da. I guess it kind of fits that it's kind of slanted because that's what Jotaro does. He never wears it like just straight on. It's always like tilted to the side or something. Snapple fact is mint comes in over 30 varieties. Cool. Man, RIP Iggy and Abdal. Ugh. And I, I, I hate it because I think Paul and Ref's going to join them. Like, unless the other, the bros come in, but like, no, I think, I think Paul and Ref's too beat up. He's going to go out like a badass or something, but man, I don't know. See, he wears it like tilted to the side. So I don't care if mine's perfect. Da, 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 da. Looking at his, looking at mine, you know, this isn't bad for 15 bucks on Amazon. Like it's, like I said, it's meant to be a cosplay hat. So yeah, not bad. It's got the little hand like emblem. It's metal. Well, it's kind of like metal. Do that or like a, no, it's, it's a hard plastic. Never mind, but it's painted decently. So. Where'd that chair come from? Was that chair always there? <laughs> right on the top of the stairs? Huh. Oh. Whoa, playing some mind games. Whoa, some praise for Polnareff. He really wants Polnareff on his side. Obviously, obviously he won't turn. Yeah, give me courage, baby. Ha <laughs> ha. 
he jumps. Whoa. I want to see his stand itself. Like, I want to learn about... Oh, here we go. Whoa. Okay. Useless, 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 useless. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, yes. Oh, thank God. He's, yeah. <laughs> oh, that makes me so happy that he's not alone. Okay. You know, it's one thing if he dies eventually, which would still suck, but I just didn't want him to be alone. Like, have the bros here with him. Oh, yeah. I, I had thought time manipulation, but it's almost like space and time manipulation. Oh, shit. Oh. 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 <laughs> no, god damn it. That's so heartbreaking. I hate it. Jotro. Wow. That's so fucking sad. So, is, st is Sunlight still the only way to kill him? <laughs> By the way, his name isn't Nutsack. Someone corrected me, but I kind of like just calling him Nutsack. I don't know. It's Nuke Saku. Okay. I'm just, I'm just happy Polnareff's not alone. If, if they, he ends up dying or something, I'll still be really sad, but at least it won't be alone. That That's good enough for me, right? Huh. Wow. That's crazy. All starting back at Jonathan. Dude, they're about to fight their great great grandfather's like body. It's mind blown. <laughs> Let's keep Raves out of this poll. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm just a joke. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Interesting. Whoa. I'm glad they're all fighting together for once. I mean, it's the last fight of the, the, the part, but at least like... Okay. I hate this nutsack guy. He's not gonna be in there. Something's in there though. Whoa, it's him? And his mouth has been gashed? Whoa, I don't even know what to think. Yeah, no shit. 
Whoa. They go into the sunlight? Yeah, hurry up, pull the ref. Whoa, they just said yeet it. Yeet, we're out of here. Okay. Whoa. What in the world was that? That was the world. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah, that's Dio for you. It hasn't changed after all this time. <laughs> Icicle on my ass. Uh, interesting. So they're almost out of sunlight, so are they going to, like, run away? But at night, you could, like, chase them down, right? His time has come. Oh, shit. I don't even think if he ran, it would matter. He would use the darkness to catch up to you and take you out. The music's great right now, by the way. <laughs> I love you, Joseph. Always. You're always great. Yeah. Wow. Oh, kind of weird to get to use Polnareff off as like bait like that, though. Sands him a huge wad of cash. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. Oh, oh, OK. Yeah, sure. I'm flooring a Kekwin. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> He's like leaning so far back. Okay. Whoa. I'm going to assume his injuries have just healed because anime logic. Yeah, okay, I'm glad. Uh, yeah. Oh. Oh, look at his eyes twinkling. Yeah, look at his smile. Yada, yada. <laughs> oh, that's great. I love the Joe Bros, man. Ah. Oh. Good grief. Yada, yada. Look at his walk. Look at that walk he's got. Dio's... Dude, he's still like, look at that. Like, that's crazy. It's isn't it Jonathan's body. It's just weird to me. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Bro. Goodbye to your head. Or to some or or that. Yeah. You're man, you got off easy. I'm surprised he didn't just kill you. Oh, ow, hey, my teeth. Sure, random business guy, you tell him what's up.
He was captain of the football team, so, you know. One-to-one -one there. Hawaii, nice. Who is this guy? Senator Phillips, okay. Well, good for you. You're going to die right now. Young buck. He calls him a young buck and he's like 130. <laughs> he was snorting like that. Yeah, no shit. He ripped your damn teeth out with his fingers. Oh, you're, you're dead. Oh, never mind. You just teleported back in. You really want this guy driving your car? This this guy. <laughs> if you don't hurry up, Dio's just gonna kill you. <laughs> okay, well, certainly an interesting situation here. Well, this guy has just gone insane and within meeting Dio for 20 seconds. That sounds about right. How long is this episode? Okay, we're like two-thirds or three-fourths the way down. I was just curious. It felt longer, but... Yeah. Oh. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter ultimately because he's after both of you. He's after the, all the Joe stars in general. Um, the, now, I'm sure I'm sure he knows that Joe Turo is the bigger threat, but, you know, he's not going to pick and choose. I imagine if he can kill Joseph, he'll kill Joseph first. Don't matter to him, probably. This, he's got to teleport the car. The sidewalk is wide enough? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, sure. He, he broke a chain with his leg. Damn, freaking Jotaro is a freaking beefcake. He just ran through all those people. No, you, this guy's going to die for sure. Yep. He's going insane. This is a dream. Ah! All these people I'm killing. That's not real. Oh. So the it's the all powerful stand has a very short range. Uh oh, Emerald splash this fool! Yeah, it's not gonna matter. It's not gonna do anything to him. He's gonna like teleport those those emeralds somewhere else or something. Oh my god, that's amazing! Whoa. An extra emerald splat. Whoa. You're just like flicking them away. That's great. Ooh. Pull back your stand, bro. Ow. 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 Damn, it's a really short range then. So uh, this is going perfectly to Joseph's plan. Use this time to analyze this the world. Like find out any weakness. I'm glad I'm glad Kakuin's okay. Kakuin. Sorry, I always say his name wrong, but I love him. 
Ow! Oh no, it was eye injury! Wow, oh my gosh. Okay, 10 meters. Okay. That's not a crazy range. Up close fighter. Yep. Dude, you already know him and Star Platinum are going to throw fists. That's going to be cool. Oh, we're not even getting credits. We're, I mean, we are, but... Whoa, the car stopped. Oh, the guy! Holy shit, he threw him like... Oh, that guy, yeah, we knew that guy was gonna die. Oh, great. Oh! Oh, shit, did they get out? No, they didn't, I don't think. Holy shit, here comes Dio. Oh. Oh, nice, okay. Damn, I love Dio's design in this. It's really good now that we're seeing him in like the full like light. Oh, okay. Hell yeah. Oh, we're getting the shorter outro version. We've only had this like once before. Um, so I should probably mention now, I do know a very small spoiler. Um, the only thing I know is that Joseph does survive the events of Stardust Crusaders and, and Jotaro. Because I know like Jotaro and Joseph are in a future parts. Uh, that's it, though. I don't know anything else. I don't know, like... I'm pr I'm just presuming that Dio gets defeated, but I don't know how or anything. Um, and I don't know what happens to Kakuin, uh or Polnareff. Um, so I'm hoping they live. I have a bad feeling they won't, though. Um, but I just want to share that now before I watch the next three. That I don't know the fates of those two. I, I, I really hope they live. I feel like they won't. But I know that Joseph and Jotaro do survive this series because I um, I can't remember what it was. But like basically I just know that like for sure that Joseph and Jotaro appear later on in the series. So um, yeah, okay. That was uh, Dio's World Part 1, right? Yeah, Dio's World Part 1. So now we're going to move on to Part 2. And... Uh, yeah, I, like I said, I'm finishing it all right now. I got three more episodes to go, and then we're done. Um, we're slowly figuring out stuff about Dio's stand, and I'm sure there's going to be a lot of incredible things in the next few episodes. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys like the hat. I'm sorry it's not like the, the greatest quality hat, but I think it, like it's shiny, and it's got like you know elements of the hat and stuff. Um, it doesn't fit properly, but... Hey, like, you know, like I said, it kind of like morphs into my hair, kind of. So, um, <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. And until next time, this has been Mighty Gazelle. Hoping you all have a mighty day.